Hello friends, myself Dinesh Damrade and today we are going to see desktop and laptop chip level motherboard repairing. My every new video will contain new content and I also show you practically on motherboard with the help of multimeter. So you can able to solve dead and power on no display cases which are the most and worst case in the desktop and laptop. So you can save your money earn money and enjoy your money so stay connected and also subscribe my channel if you like the video give thumbs up and leave comment in the comment box now move toward our first lecture which is a basic electronics let's see welcome friends today we are going to see basic component and the concept of motherboard first we are going to see basic component then we are going to see circuits in the laptop and desktop as you know difference between the desktop and laptop. Desktop contains 15 circuits and laptop contains 23 circuits. First we are going to see basic component. Let's see. Resistor, capacitor, coil or inductor, diode, transistor, MOSFET, crystal and fuse. Also we are going to see Attribute related all these components like function of the component, real shape, denoting letter. Also, we are going to see OK condition and faulty condition, leakage condition of all these components one by one. Then we are moving toward the desktop. Desktop contains 15 circuits like VRM circuits, RAM circuit, South Bridge, North Bridge, Standby Voltage. USB circuit, SATA port, PS2 port, LAN port, BIOS, CMOS battery, sound circuit, ROM identification, clock generator and VGA. <coughs> In the uh, desktop and laptop, we are going to conduct two sessions. One session is theory session and other is a practical. In theory session, we are going to see circuits on a whiteboard and now in a practical session we are going to see uh, part tracing of the circuit with the help of multimeter then we are moving toward the laptop laptop contain 23 circuits like volt in vrm circuit ram circuit step down circuit charging and discharging circuit north bridge usb supply clock generator sata port hard disk SATA port, DVD writer, fan circuit, VGA, CPU thermal, keyboard, touch pad, LAN port, audio, eSATA, PCH, CMOS, BIOS and Wi-Fi. First we are going to see desktop because desktop contains very simple circuits and all the circuits also present in a laptop so first we are going to see desktop then we are going to see laptop so you can easily understand the laptop circuits and that's all for today's session in the next session we are going to see basic electronic component like resistor capacitor coil or inductor etc in details so stay connected also subscribe my channel if you like the video give thumbs up and also leave the comment if you have any problem, mention in the comment box. I will give you solution on the problem. So, thank you. See you soon.